<laughs> That's funny. All right, on to <laughs> black <laughs> versus That's blue. Funny. Sorry. <laughs> hey, you stole my ball. That's all right. All right, hope versus hype. The Yankees had an eight-game winning streak before they lost tonight to the White Sox. Um, they got rid of all their high-priced older players, and this was supposed to kind of be rebuilding time. My question is, is this hope for them? Do they make the Man, playoffs? Man, fuck the Yankees. Straight up. <laughs> <laughs> now, why why you say that? Because he's an Orioles fan. I'm an fan. Orioles fan. Yeah. <laughs> no, but no, I mean, it's always fuck the Yankees. It's like it's fuck Pittsburgh and it's fuck Duke. But it's way too early. Okay. It's 150 games left. <laughs> I mean, baseball. we don't know. It's, it's baseball. It might be more than that. <laughs> right. But, um, I mean, the Orioles started off 7-0 and last year, and we got to the one-game playoff. So, it it, 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 I don't, I don't, I don't put any weight behind it yet. We got to see. Now, if they won twenty in a row, that's something. <laughs> yeah, but even though it's, it's still one hundred and forty games, right? <laughs> <laughs> but still, at that point, it's, it's an average showing up. You know what I mean? Like right. there's, there's it, something there. Yeah, I mean, getting Chapman back was big. Yeah. I think um, <laughs> that was the biggest hustle. Ever. During, <laughs> for real, during the A game winning streak, they played the Cardinals and the Tampa Bay Rays, who right. are terrible. Mm. Um, all those games were at home. That's another thing. Um, that's another thing. And and CeCe Sabathia, who has been on the downward trajectory, is actually pitching well. Did he lose weight yet? No, <laughs> he didn't. But first, but he's he's rediscovered something. Um, but I don't Steroids. know. I don't know. I'm <laughs> not psycho. I'm not going there. <laughs> Human growth hormone. <laughs> but all I'm saying is, is that you know, I doubt that he's going to be able to sustain it. But then, more importantly, Michael Pineda who uh, during that streak had a perfect game through, you know, I think seven innings. He has been the most inconsistent pitcher probably in Major League Baseball for at least the last. They've been waiting for him to show up forever. So, you know, with with those, if you're depending on those two guys, and that's what's going well for them is their pitching. They both got the same doctor. <laughs> well, <laughs> if that's the case, then, then it, maybe it's hope then. You add the fact that Gary Sanchez has been out, Didi Gregorius yeah, has been you, out. You you hope they they pass their test. <laughs> <laughs> that is the hope because it's hype. All um, right, hit or flop. Last week, um, oh there was a report that Beast uh, Mode had signed mm. to the Raiders. You sound a little hurt over no, there. I, I, I can I can hear him smiling. <laughs> no, see, this, this is the thing, though. This is the thing. I'm not exactly sold that it's a hit. Really? I'm Why? not so Speak that. on yeah, that. Speak on that. And, and the re- it's a great name. He was a great player. Last time, le- he was off a year. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He'll be 32 next week. Been mm-hmm. eating Skittles. Uh, and we know he's been eating a lot of Skittles. He does look chunky. I will it, say that. The last year he played, he only played seven games. Mm-hmm. So now we're talking two years off. A 32-year-old running back. Are you raising your hand yes, for I'm a reason? Yes, I'm raising my hand. <laughs> Dad, um, hit or flop? Um, I'm saying it's a hit because when he played those seven games, what line was he playing behind? Mm. And then now he's playing uh, under the behind the second best line in the league. Mm. Yeah, let's okay. I mean, I'm, what what pat yourself they, on the back, brother? No, I mean, this this is this thing, is though. this is your time. They, they, <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they hey, say hey, what, hey, why uh, you got me doing your job? <laughs> this guy. No, this, this, this Come on, though. man. Our running, our running game, our running um, blocking is not that great. Our run block is not that well, great. Your pass blocking. You had Kenyon at running back great. last year, though. I mean, unless if Kenyon was 6'3", 260 pounds. I think the thing is, is I think it's a win for situational football. I think it's a hit from a situational football perspective because now you have a guy that you know will be able to go and get the tough yards. Yeah. You talk about the fact that he's 32, right? He's not running away from anybody. That's no. not what they got him there for. Yeah. <laughs> they got him there because he's going to take care of the football. And they're mm-hmm. not going to pass it on the one yard. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. You not, saw to mention, not to mention the off-the-field benefit. This is a win for Oakland. This is a win for the Oakland, emphasis yeah. on Oakland right. Raiders. Well, I had a question about that because I think that it could be positive. But... I mean, he's he's done a good job of saving his money, doing stuff for the community. But being back home, is it all? Is it a definite hit for that? Because you know, oh yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. There's, I, always, I there's always there's always the home. He is I mean, beloved. He's yeah. beloved, not but he's still in the, the most not he ignorant. Don't get it, but he, yeah, he that's is. why he's beloved. Yeah, I know. It's but the Bay. He's, I, he's, <laughs> I just worried about like he's ignorant, but he's not a miscreant. Right, no, I get that, so, but but there's sometimes you know you grow up and I, you know. I, I think it's gonna be. I think it's actually gonna to and to to further go at, at Les's point. 
I think it's actually going to allow him to play inspired football. So that yeah, the the stats say and his body says and his age says that he should be on the on the downward slope. But I think playing in Oakland, I think it will doesn't invigorate even, him. It in doesn't a way. even matter. You got E forty. <laughs> wait, no, no, I'm serious. You got E forty, Andre Ward, and Marshawn Lynch. Yeah, those are the the the, the guys who only got to pay a for a thing in Oakland. Yeah, uh, but <laughs> you know that there's one big thing that we're missing here. They're not going to be in Oakland. <laughs> no, the two years. This is that's, a this is a two year thing. I don't even know. If he ain't long. leaving the house. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he this gonna is, probably play this season, this and, is, and that's it. This is to get it out of his system, and mm. for Oakland to, to smooth the transition over. And I think it helps David Carr. It helps them in situational football. I think it's a hit. Can you see, when he does a, a Lambo leap into the black hole? Come on, dog. <laughs> it's gonna be crazy. All right. For all twelve people that are still there. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> All right, newsworthy or nothing to see. Eli Manning. This is something I didn't see much Yikes. about. Yikes. So, Eli was sent an email. Running his, gang. Yeah, to the, the equipment manager saying, hey, um, can you get me two helmets that look game-worn? Huh. Basically so he could sell them as game-worn mem- memorabilia. Now he's in a lawsuit for fraud. So is this newsworthy or nothing? To and see? the and the Giants as well. And the I Giants believe. Well. Are the Why Giants was he well? doing it? He has obligations with some memorabilia company. Yeah, yeah I think. I, a pair, yeah. I don't think it's. I actually. I think it's custom to do this, where it's like, hey, yeah. give me some stuff that looks game worn. The problem is, is they, a, they just got caught yeah, up. Yeah, sending well, emails and stuff. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. I, to me, I don't. I can't make heads or tails of it right now it's, it's early those <laughs> the emails look damning though <laughs> you know <laughs> the, the reason why it's, it's no longer newsworthy is because we voted for a president who grabs <laughs> who admittedly grabbed vaginas i don't so think like that's this word, but yes well no one cares <laughs> yeah. my right. point is there's a point now where it's like this is like whatever let them do it they're gonna pay some money he's gonna, gonna pay right yeah, it's, it's gonna like, settle the, the, the i only, think it's newsworthy for the for the standpoint of the manning brand right yeah they're they're the most they're, they're the first family of the nfl and, and you they just, have this the, is not what you would expect yeah the integrity yeah, factor of i mean it. because you know fox news did try to destroy al jazeera after that story came out but Whoa, it's cool there is that <laughs> 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 Big head. 